I'm going to teach you how to make art with homemade clay and mushrooms. You only need things from around your house, so anyone can make this. We're going to start by making the clay first. We're going to need baking soda, cornstarch, and water. The measurements are displayed on the screen. We're going to bring all those ingredients to a boil and then lower to medium to low heat. It will turn to mashed potato consistency very fast within 5 minutes. Once you've achieved that mashed potato consistency, take it off the stove top and wrap it around a cold, wet towel. I let this sit for about 20 minutes before I started to knead the dough. It will start off in a really crumbly consistency, but soon turn it into a smooth dough clay-like texture. Then you'll start to roll out your dough to your desired thickness. As for shapes, I wanted to achieve a circular shape, so I just used different size cups from around my house and achieved the perfect circle. Once you have all of those pressed out, you'll want to move your clay onto parchment paper. You will now prepare those forged mushrooms by baking them at 150 for 2-3 to three hours. I used two techniques to decorate with my mushrooms. The first was pressing and creating a mold of the mushroom shape, and the second was simply placing the mushrooms onto the clay. I ended up painting the clay molds to resemble the turkey tail mushroom that I used to press them with, and it ended up beautiful. I ended up decorating these all over my house and even made them into ornaments. I even used moss to decorate with. And here are all of them together and they are just gorgeous. You can put these anywhere around your house and decorate with them in any way you would like. If you would like to learn more about foraging for mushrooms or educate yourself on the native species of New Hampshire mushrooms, check out my Canva in the link below and you will find a whole infographic and how to foraging and a lot of information about the native species in New Hampshire. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have so much fun making your mushroom art.